Mm, they started walking. Everyone, my Lord, was doing good. Everywhere he went, he was doing good. A mighty healer, and he heals the lepers. Oh, and the cripples saw him. They started walking. Everywhere he went, my Lord was doing good. Oh, everywhere he went, he was doing good. A mighty healer, he heals the leper. When the cripples saw him, they started walking. Oh, everywhere he went, my Lord was doing good. Father, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, we Yeshua Christ to demo. Ready, Yeshua, we didn't come for. Lord, we thank you, we bless you, we give you all the praise. Thank you for another moment. Thank you for another chance in life. Thank you for another opportunity. We give you all the praise, we give you all the glory. It's not by might, it's not by power. It's not by something that we did or we gave. It's all by the grace of you, Jehovah. It's the death and the resurrection of you, the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you for coming. Thank you for dying for us. Thank you for saving us. Pray the Lord as your word come. Come and speak to us. Come and talk to us. Change our lives. Lead us. Protect us. Speak to us, spirits. In Jesus' name we pray with thanksgiving. Amen. What can wash away my sins? Nothing but the blood. The blood of Jesus. What? Can make me whole again. Nothing but the blood, the blood of Jesus. Oh, prayer and she is the flow that makes me white as snow. No, I had I found. I know nothing but the blood, the blood of Jesus. Have you been to Jesus for the clean and sin power? And are you washed in the blood of the Lamb? Are your God a man spotless? Are they white as snow? Are you washed? In the blood of Ella. Again, happy belated Mother's Day to every mother, every woman. May the Lord bless you all. May the Lord open the heavens unto you. May he cause each and every one of you to walk in favor. Let the grace of God be abundant unto you in the name of Jesus Christ. Jesus is coming. Jesus is Lord. One day he is he will come in his glory. The Bible says in 1 Corinthians 15 and the verse 52, in a moment, in a twinkle of an eye, at the last trumpet, for the trumpet of God shall sound, the trumpet of God shall sound, and the dead shall be raised, corrupt, incorruptible, and we shall be changed. For this corruptible must be put on incorruptible. This mortal must put immortality. So when this corruptible shall have put on incorruptible, and this mortal have put on immortality, then shall be brought to pass the saying that this written death is swallowed up in victory. Death shall be swallowed up in victory. And brother, my sister, a child of God, saints of Jehovah, somebody created in the image of God, my brother, my sister, just ask yourself, do you know the Lord Jesus Christ? Many about mommy, papa, we are with 
ye me bisa o se oni me urade ni me urade oni me urade this is this question may seems too difficult especially somebody who have sat in the church many years somebody who preaches the gospel somebody who sing about the gospel it may look it may seem that what question is this but do you know god do you know god there are some people they have seen god but they don't know god they have heard about god or jesus christ but they don't know him to know somebody is to know everything about him or her i every day say that we are twins myself and my twin brother we are very identical but many people have seen him but they don't know him but i know him i know him i can tell you everything about him because i know him i am with him and we do everything together bini aba bini aba ma so unu ma urade obi wa be pre unu urade wa te wo no ho asem go to church they hold the bible they have a form of godliness but they don't know the lord jesus christ himself because the reason why they call them christians they are walk and everything look like the lord jesus christ jesus said not everybody that says lord lord will enter into the kingdom of god but they that do the will of the father what of what you mommy papa christian my brother my sister not everybody that have a form of godliness <laughs> it's it's a christian not everybody <laughs> that <laughs> confess or prophesy that they are christians except you walk the walk of the cross except you live your life the bible says that we should present ourselves as a living sacrifice holy and acceptable unto god and fire who see us up for it yes yes and who need them and they were a thing and probably said christ only be a baby who tell me mommy there be a who tell me be a ram but who was you want to suffer for it yes yes and who need them and they were a thing if he says oh poor poor yes whether you believe it or not whether you like it or not jesus one day will come and if he don't come in our generation surely he will come the bible says for nobody knows the time that he will come one day he will come in his glory in a moment in the twinkle of an eye at the last trumpet when the trumpet shall sound hallelujah there is a song that i love so much he says that when the trumpet shall sound and time shall be no more when the trumpet sounds and time shall be no more by when is a over 90 year 90 year we am remo 90 year walk faithfully because there is a judgment whether we believe it or not one day we will stand before the judgment seat of Christ and we will be accounted for every day people think that just that when you are about to die then you say god save me immediately then you say and you go to heaven the bible says our works yenuma bible says yenuma be die chi yenuma papa we are your boni are we your you are come for we will are come for and that is my prayer that you begin to live a righteous life begin to live a righteous life and you see the glory of god may the lord cause us to walk faithfully before him that when he show up when he comes we will be people who have sanctified themselves and holy unto the lord the bible says we should be transformed by the renewal of our mind be it transformed by the renewal of our mind jesus is coming jesus is coming my brother my sister are you ready a child of god are you ready are you ready are you preparing yourself to meet his coming and the lord bless you today i want to start a message that i have titled don't give up don't quit all 
things are possible with God to the other belief. Your situation does not conclude your story. What people are saying, that is it's not your future. Don't sit down. Hope in the Lord. Hope in the Lord. The Bible says, faithful is he who has called, for he will do it. Yes, be patient with the Lord. One day, one morning, the Bible says, Weeping may endure for a night. Weeping may endure for a night. But joy comes in the morning. Meaning that during the night, during the short time, things will not be as you want it to be. That under the sun, everything is temporary. One morning, one day, your day will come. A day of glory will come. A day of singing will come. A day of laughter will come. A day of rejoicing will come. A day of healing will come. In the name of Jesus Christ. Pray that the Lord will cause you to walk in Him. The Bible says, for the joy of the Lord is our strength. As a Christian, as a child of God, your strength is the joy of God, your joy in the Lord. Because it is the Spirit of God that carries you through adversity and through pain and through troubles. How do you my dear me tell me? And you know, I'm going to go on in the bit of your crowd. When you read Job chapter 14 and the verse 1, let me go and read Job chapter 14 and the verse 1. And let's hear the word of God. Let's hear the word of God. It says that man that is born of a woman is of a few days. Meaning that our days on earth, our days on earth are few. That is why the psalmist said, God make me to know my days. So that I will apply wisdom. My brother, my sister, I am here. The Bible says, I am here. 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 I don't know what you are going through. I don't know your problem. But this morning, this afternoon, this evening, I come to you with the word of God. That may the Lord strengthen you. May the Lord empower you. The Bible says he gives power to the weak. And those that don't have might, he increases their strength. May the Lord revive you. May the Lord increase you. May he cause you to walk in the favor. May he cause you to walk in abundance. In the name of Jesus. When you come home, you How near man ye be a phone nemuno? Nyame mount kunim dear woman. Oh, you never ready yes, Christ with him. Men can't draw on us, and near men in our top. Ah, men can't draw on us, and yea, yea. Catch on us, say you what you say. On my soon, soon, one more day. On our genitino, a dim cunim da. Say you what you say. My soon, soon, one more day. On our geniti, a cunim. I bring you now. I say Yehovah Tiasi, Mama Yeshu Suma Hodi, Wo Wo Na Wo Jini Di Inkunim Brini Na Inkunim Inkunim Moja Di Shitong Kunim Inkunim Kunim Inkunim Ma Brini Na I say Yehovah Tiasi. My answer is my word. Wana, wajini di ingunim abrinina. Don't quit. Don't give up. With God, all things are possible. Despite the things, don't look as it seems you want it to be. That's not mean that that is the end of the matter. Don't write yourself off if God has not written you off. Don't conclude your story if God has not concluded it. 
For he knows that what he has for you. Not evil, but to give you a future and a hope. Remember every day of your life. It is Jesus who said, I am with you to the end of this life. He knows where he is taking you. The Bible says, for man that is born of woman is of a few days and full of trouble. Life is full of trouble. A child of God, listen to me. Woman, listen to me. You are not a survivor, you are a warrior. The day you were born on earth, the day you begin fighting this life, and whether the devil like it, whether people like it, you win. So long as you have Jesus, the Bible says Christ in you is the hope of glory. Remember in John he said that greater is he that is in us than the one that is in the world. If God be for you, who can be against you? God, he knows what you are going through. One day, you will see that everything will work in your favor. Today, I want to talk about four lepers. Four lepers. The Bible calls them lepers. And in the olden days, if you are a leper, your situation is worse. Nobody will regard you. <laughs> you are not the talk. Even within your home, you are not accepted. People are around you. They don't consider you. And so your dwelling place is always at the back of the gates. You become the last class that people consider. I pray that your situation will change. Be patient with the Lord. Be patient with the Lord. My brother, my sister, don't rush. I remember when I started ministry, a woman called me and sat me down and said, Osof war. Osof war. And then the Osof war being in frame. I was sitting down and I was saying to myself, what shall we gain? If we gain all these buildings, we gain everything, and we lose our life, what do we gain? <laughs> I was sitting there, I told myself, never, hey, even if I have one, one penny, one dollar, I will worship God faithfully. My brother, my sister, our aim and our end is heaven. I believe in heaven, I believe in hell. And so we will walk this walk with Christ until one day he comes in his glory. Don't quit, don't give up. Don't look at yourself and, and conclude your story. And say that there is no hope for me. My brother, my sister, Jesus in your boat. When Jesus is leading you, he knows where he is taking you. If you have forgotten, let me remind you a child of God. The Bible says it is God who ordered the step of the righteous. The step of the righteous. The Lord will order your step. That's why that your today is no good. That's no mean that your tomorrow will be the same. You don't conclude your story. Don't let the situation in which you are walking through bring the worst out of you. There are many people when they confront my situation, when things are not going right, it brings the worst out of them. There are many men, there are many women that will allow the situation to control them. But my brother, my sister, when you are here, Bible says, I dare you. They, they, those that love the world, everything work together for them. It is working in your favor. God knows where he is taking you. God knows the place that he is leading you to. One morning, one day, you will sing song. <laughs> and you my brother, my sister, one morning you sing a song of Moses after you have crossed the Red Sea. Bible says when the Israelites crossed the Red Sea and the enemies were thrown into the Red Sea, they looked back and saw the sea taking their enemies, they rejoice and sing the song of Moses. 
Asi watu wonya kopo na kuwa mosenyum. Eni e kwama ni nyumse. E rade nyankopo. Adi nyina sutufu. Unyuma ye kesie. Na ye wawa. E rade nyuma ye kesie. Otofuwa utie mami tie miye. Adi so ansume rade ye. Again listen to me. Except you don't walk faithfully and truthfully in the Lord. Adi so wana tinya mimu ye. Christo ni tie me. Mami tie me. Bia na ukura baibu no kwa. We are sick. I did near my mouth. Nansu, believe you me, men and women of God that are not faithful in this call, they don't have peace within them. Unya, unya, one ejeta. Nyamen kahun and yamen tumu. Nyamen kahun. Not that God has a plan for your life. Wunyame. God has a plan for your life. He is leading you. God will cause that plan. To come to pass. A plans for warfare. And not for calamity. To give you a future. And a hope. When you have money, you have money. When you have money, you have money. Yes, Christ. Let's go and read our scripture for the day. Second Kings. Chapter 7. And we will dwell. In verse 3. The verse 3 and 4. 2 Kings chapter 7. Don't quit. Don't give up. Don't tell yourself that your situation has come to an end. My brother, my sister. With Jesus. With Jesus. With Jesus. With Jesus in your boat. All things are possible. In Jeremiah he said, I am the God of all flesh. Is there anything too difficult for me? Be an awesome Bi ana ukeke wani manya me sompa. Bi bi ana ni pani na numse usumi ya me. Na so akwai ni wana monye. Me mwe me she wo wo na ma kwam boni so. Ai ai afa kwam boni so. Bi num kura bible they are not men and women of God. Me she wo mo na nkan jero so mu di ye wo mo ni ye ni je. Mo ni ye ni je. Ni je. Bi a wo ni je ni bi a wo kura Kristo no kura mu ye. Nya mi mo ni je ba ye wa ho den. The joy of the Lord will be your strength. Hallelujah. We're making a journey with the Lord Jesus Christ. And he will never fail us. God bless you. Now, don't quit. Never give up. With God, all things are possible. Second Kings chapter 7. And the verse 3 and 4. He said, and there were four lepers. Four Leprous men at the entrance in of the gates, and they said one to another, Why sit we here until we die? If we say we will enter into the city, then the famine is in the city. Decisions, decisions, decisions in life, my brother, my sister, decision. Either your decision, the decisions you take will make you or it will break you. I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. I get it. Not in the Bible say, people who are led by the Spirit of God, they are the children of God. I every day ask, if this God who created this heaven and earth created man in his image, if you allow God to lead you in this life, you think he will lead you wrong. My brother, ask yourself, woman, ask yourself, do you think God will lead you in the wrong direction? The one who created everything, who made everything, for he knows where he's taking you. No wonder the Bible says that it is God who ordered the steps of the righteous. May he order your steps into greatness. May he cause the heaven to be open unto you. May the Lord cause you to walk in the abundance of heaven. In the name of Jesus Christ. When you no more, He is a faithful God. And the Bible says in Psalm 25, in the verse 14. That the secret of the Lord is with them that fears him. And he shows them his covenant. So immediately you begin to fear God. 
and begin to walk in faithfulness. The Lord will begin to order your steps. He will lead you the way because he, you have been covenanted unto him. There is something good that is waiting for you. Speak to yourself. Speak to your spirit man or spirit woman within you and say, it, ah, it is well. It is well. It is well. It is well. It is well with your soul. I <laughs> say, it is well. No matter. No matter the storm. No matter what you go, you go through. When sea, <laughs> says, when peace like a river attended my way, when sorrows like sea be rose wrong. My brother, my sister, it does not matter the seeds that be rose, uh, that, that rose in your life. Jesus will speak. Let the master speak. And everything will be well. He said, if we go into the city, the famine is there. We shall die there. And if we sit here, we die also. Now therefore, come and let us fall unto the host of the Syrians. If they save us alive, we shall live alive. And if they kill us, we shall but die. And so three things, three choices. <laughs> For the beginning of wisdom is the fearing of God. And then Tina Yana, I am a woman, P. Here, me one woman, Christopher, my brain, especially a woman, Ghana. Say, Christoni, a child of a Christian, that you have come into the Lord. Have the wisdom of God. He sit down, sit down in, in the house of God, seven days, 24 hours, thinking that manna will fall from heaven. <laughs> it doesn't work that way. Bible who trap Bible who who buy the crystal was so no nyami mo nyansa. Then the Bible say Jesus Christ the kind, Jesus Christ. Or say the say we are say for the Christ the nyansa say ahi ni anima. Jesus said it. Why? Because instead of Christians realizing. And after you have prayed, instead of making a move, a Christian will sit down, waiting for the opportunities to come into, into his life. Instead of making, my brother, my sister, let me tell you, I continue to tell you, if you're a pastor, if you're a man of God, a Christian has to make money legally, legally. I was a Christian, you have to work and, and get money legally. And so, so don't sit down and think that manna will fall from heaven. I every day tell you that even the day that God gave the Israelites manna, the manna did not fall oh, in their rooms. They, they had to walk and gather it. Step out of your room as a child of God. And when you step out in faith, the favor of God will go before you. Shazir to an among our Christian, Perjuma, to an among the Perjuma, the found Sayya Juma, when you make a one Sanwa Juma. And then you, you, you regret. And you, you perish. May the Lord give us wisdom and knowledge in the name of Jesus Christ. Many are dying. Many are perishing. Many are wailing. Calm down. Calm down right now. A child of God, listen, there is a battle to engage. Say, there is a battle, engage for your life. You have to fight it and win. This life is war. Jesus himself said it. Go and read John chapter 10 and the verse 10. He said, The thief cometh not but to steal, to kill, and to destroy. But I come that you may have life and have it more abundantly. God through Paul also wrote in Ephesians chapter 6, the verse 10, he said, 
Finally, my brethren, a child of God, be strong in the Lord and His mighty power. Be strong because when you come to the verse 12, he says that for we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against evil forces, forces that are very strong. They are very strong. And so you need to stand. You need to stand. And so as a child of God, the enemy will fight you immediately. The day you accepted Christ as your personal savior, the day you were born into a Christian family, and the womb that gave birth to you identify itself as a womb that Christ himself has saved. And from that day, it's all battle. It's all battle. Life is full of war. It's full of trouble. That is why God, through James, wrote in James 5 and verse 16, so if, if anyone afflicted or troubled, let him pray. Let that person pray. Because you cannot win this battle without prayer. A Christian who don't pray is a prayerless Christian. If you don't pray, you sit down thinking that everything will come in your way. It doesn't work that way. Life is war. When we were growing, many cars, especially the bone shakers, you see at the back, they, they write at the back, life is war. You have to fight it and you have to win it. That is why the Bible says, man born of a woman, his days are few, but full of trouble. But the good news is that Jesus said, in this life, you have trouble. But be patient, for I have overcome this world. And God, through John, wrote in John, that whoever is born of God, whoever is born, or be a Christian, whoever is born of God, overcome this world. My brother, my sister, you are a winner. Except maybe you don't want to walk faithfully with the Lord. <laughs> Except maybe you want to break the covenant between you and heaven. Except that you don't want to be obedient to the word of God. If you become obedient, the eye of the Lord will run, is run to, to, to look for somebody. Read First Corinthians, 2 Corinthians 16 and the verse 9. The Bible says, for the eye of the Lord is running to and fro. God wants to show himself on behalf of a perfect and a righteous person. He wants to show up. I pray that you, you begin to walk. <laughs> Too many of God's people are losing the battle of life. They are losing. In marriages, many women, men and women are losing. Let a mistake in the marriage. A woman will pack her baggage. A man will pack and begin to leave. Give excuses. Begin to give excuses that the whole world will support them. Clapping their hands. <laughs> leading them to destroy. You win. May God give you power and the abundance of heaven to win this life. To win this life in the name of Jesus Christ. Don't quit. Never give up. With God, everything is possible. That's why that they have written you off. That's not me that God has, has also written you off. That's why that they have tagged you. That's not mean that God has tagged you. I every day tell you, don't think that your enemy is God's enemy. Never think. God said, I have rejected Saul. But David, I have chosen David. And so no matter the number of people that, that like Saul, that were with Saul, chasing David, does not mean that God hated David. One thing God has made me to understand and know in this ministry, God bless you, the great man of God, and a brother. God has made me to know that don't think that your enemy is God's enemy. There are some people, they are chosen of God. There are some men and women of God, despite that they have heard and they are doing their own thing, does not mean that God has forsaken them. Hey, every day you hear testimony about men who walk the walk of this world, use the gospel anyhow. 
but God will draw them. And so, my brother, my sister, don't think that life has come to an end. Don't quit. Don't throw in the towel. Jesus in your boat. Jesus in your, at your corner. You win this life. Let me go and talk about the lepers. The Bible says that there was great famine because the, the Syrians came and took over Israel. And caused a great famine in Israel. But a time came when the prophet Elisha prophesied. The Bible says the Spirit of God came upon the man of God. And he prophesied that tomorrow by this time, a life will change. That is my prayer for you. That the word of God will come into your life and change your situation. Change your situation in the name of Jesus Christ. The angel of the Lord told Sarah, what do you love within you? Go and read Genesis chapter 18. When they told Sarah that the year by this time we will come and you have a child. This woman looked at her. Look around her. Because the Bible says she, she, she was old. The Bible even said that within women she has already gone. Meaning that she has passed her menopause many years ago. I don't know whether the husband has also passed his andropos. But the woman, her menopause has already passed. And everything around Sarah did not look something that if somebody prophesied to you that it's going to be, your situation is going to change tomorrow. And so the, the love that she loved was genuine. Because her situation was worse. Don't give up. The, the good is yet to come. Don't allow yourself for the situation to bring the worst in you. To do things that will be contrary to the word of God. Stand up. Stand up for Jesus. He suggests on the cross. Lift up his royal banner. <laughs> Don't give up. From victory unto victory. He said, me, the Lord shall lead. One day, God will give you victory on the, uh, every, on the other side. Go and read Exodus chapter 17 on the mountain of Rephidim. If the Israelites have given up, if Moses' hand uh, was given up, if they had given up, they would have lost the battle. The Bible says Moses' hand became so tired and heavy. And when it, his hand go down, Israel will lose him. Don't allow yourself to go down. Don't get down in life and think in that your situation, my brother, my sister, hear me. Your situation is better than somebody. Your life is better than somebody. I heard a story about a man who wanted to hang himself because life was very miserable. So took everything and he was going to hang himself. Took off his shirt, his pants, <laughs> with trousers. When we say pants, it's stress as Americans say pants. Took everything. And, and stood on the tree, tied the rope. Another man was passing and praying that God would give him something to wear. And all of a sudden he saw a shirt and the trousers. Then ran, thanking God and jumping us and took it and was praising God. The man that was going to hang himself realized that uh, something that you said you don't like it, somebody like it. Don't look at yourself and look, don't look that your children are being destroyed. Your life is going backwards. Jesus, one morning you see the glory of God. Only be faithful unto the Lord. The Bible says, in all, Job did not sin against God. Job never sinned against God. My brother, my sister, Job never sinned against God. He was faithful unto the end. And God loves such people. 
No wonder God was able to boast before the devil that have you considered my servant Job? And God began to list what he knows about Job. Say he is perfect. He shines evil. Meaning that God has tested him and know him. If, if it was to be us, my brother, my sister, we would have thrown in the towel and given up. If it was to be me, maybe I would have given up a long time on God. The Bible says, they that wait on the Lord. They that have patience on the Lord. No wonder before that he says, he give power to the weak. And those do, who do not have might, he, he increase. The Lord will increase your strength. When you read First Corinthians chapter 10, and the verse 30, he said, no temptation that have come on us. God knows the strength. <laughs> and so everything that God allows in our way, that is why he says that everything works together for good, together for good, for those who love the Lord and those who are called according to his purpose. Papa <laughs> He is, you see, the reason why some of us, we have we mean business with the Lord because of the things that we have gone through. Because your and I always thank God for the womb that gave birth to us. Thank God for my mother. She taught us how to pray. This woman is nameless, faceless. Nobody knows him. Nobody regarded him. I remember. And I was passing. And I went there. I went there. And I was sitting beside her. And my, my brother was also standing. A man and a woman was passing. I say, hey, mama, want money? Or say, hey, or say, hey. And mama, who are first? And you're here, you My brother, my sister. No, people did not even believe that <laughs> she has children like us. My new about me, new about my. Because with with nothing, she had something that was Christ in her. And taught us how to pray. Taught us how to overcome this situation through prayer. Christ only here with me, mama, it's your mama. No wonder the Bible says we should train our children the way they should go. When they grow, they will not depart. Teach them the word of God. Teach them how to pray. <laughs> Sow something in them. Sow the word of God in them. They will not give up. <laughs> My brother, the Bible says there was a famine in the land of Israel. Nowhere. The man of God came in and prophesied. Tomorrow by this time, our situation will change. See, this situation will change. Let me read the Bible. Second Kings, the verse seven, the verse one to three. He said, then Elijah said, "Hear ye the word of the Lord, that says the Lord, tomorrow about this time shall a measure of fine flour be sold for a shekel, and two measure a belly of a shekel in the gates of Samaria." Then the Lord, on whose hand the king lay in answer the man of God and said, Behold, if the Lord would make windows in heaven, my destiny be. He said, Behold, thou shalt see it with thy eyes, but I shall not eat thereof. Honestly, there are some situations. I say, Listen to me. Honestly, there are some situations. If you don't have the Spirit of God, you conclude it. I remember they took me to, to pray for. A man took me to the, <laughs> to the side of a man who was dying, a dying bed. Immediately I got there and I saw the situation. I almost concluded. And so um, when I was about to give up on, on him, then I heard a still small voice telling me that the, that is the reason why I brought you here. My brother called the name of Jehovah and that was a miracle. Don't allow your situation. The situation was so bad and so porous. 
that the, the man that was standing at the gate waiting on the king told Elisha, how possible? How possible? Even if God is open the heavens, it cannot, my situation it cannot change. Look at how sickness has, has pinned me or battered me down. She said, yeah, 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 yeah. And everybody, when they are calling you, they call you with your problem. You have been identified by your problem. Just be faithful unto God. The Bible says, a broken heart. The Lord loves a broken heart. And those that have contrite spirit, the Lord never forsake. God is nearer to those whose heart is broken. So, he said, I know my ships, and my ships know me. What of what would hear me, Papa? My brother God knows you. Walk in righteousness. The reason why we don't see the glory of God. Because we are not ready to walk in righteousness. But when you read Isaiah 59 and the verse 1, it says, For the hand of the Lord is not short. Neither his ear, heavy, or hardened, but because of iniquity. Our sins separate us from the Lord. Iniquities separate us. I every day tell you now, continue to tell you, you cannot find God where sin is. And that's why that the grace of God through Jesus Christ has given us opportunity that snow make us or quarantine us to live in sin. It does not give us the privilege to continue to sin. Free born him, praise him with free born him. Sin is sin. There is no degree of sin. Every sin is sin. And it drives the Lord away from you. And open every avenue for the enemy to enter. Fedia na uchajo. Chajo. Sinya mi bini ho. Wane kachyo se uradini ho. Wane kachyo se uradini ho. Many men and women. Great men. In the Bible. Throw in the towel. At the point of adversity. Throw in the towel. Talk about John the Baptist. Talk about Elijah. Came to a crisis in their life. And great men. Were running away. I pray that you will not give up for the good is yet to come. Don't laugh within your spirit and say it is impossible. With God, all things are possible. If you believe, you see the glory of God. Udiye Jidi. Udiye Jidi. Believe it. You see, in the Chi language, faith and believing, we pronounce it the same Jidi. But when you come to the English word, believing is different from faith. You have faith in God. You have faith in God. But you believe. One day I'll, 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 I'll preach and teach about it. When you believe, believing is a, a, a firm confidence that it is there. I pray that you will understand it in the name of Jesus Christ. Jesus is coming. Yes, Uba, Christoni, I would tell me yes, Uba. I was your brother, I get your one in same. Radi Pobi, what you are talking about? I'm going to be in your name. It is my prayer that it will be you. Paul Huechi, deny yourself and follow him. A dear Biara, a chunku, we are said, dear Biara, a man who knew your name, your name, out of what would tell everywhere that you are listening to me. And now, any young funny man, you want to grace or grace or grace or grace or one say grace or one and watch out, one say grace or one, but you don't want to do the right thing, then you say grace or grace or grace, continue to sit down. 
Continue to sit down and talk about grace and don't change your life. I pray the Spirit of God over your life. I pray. And Bible says, every day I say, there are some people, they have heard about Christ, but they don't know Him. He's so sweet. And somebody sang a song. There is a name I love to hear. I love to say it. It's worth. It sounds like music in my ears. The sweetest name on earth. Oh, how I love. The name Jesus is so sweet. It's so sweet. He's so sweet. Jesus is so sweet. When he comes into your life, he opens every avenue. Elijah has, Elijah has prophesied. That somebody's yes, situation will change tomorrow. Oh, everybody say, the man said no. They are no will be sure, will be sure. <laughs> like some of us, some people can look at us and say that they are not a coetry. A coetry will be a brand and will be a man of my brother, my sister. Heaven is listening to us. Yes, heaven has accepted us. We know what where we are going. We know what we are preaching. We know who have called us. We know. We know that one day we will lay down our pain and our trouble in exchange for a crown. <laughs> there is a song that goes on the hill far away, stood an old rugged cross, the emblem of suffering and shame. How we love this. Uh, and he ends out that one day we will lay down in exchange for a crown. We will lay down our pain, we will lay down our trouble in exchange for a crown. Okay. <laughs> I am preaching the word of God. The infallible word, the true word of God. We are When I sit down, I don't understand. In this word, fame and, and, and all this. And that is why the Bible says that godliness, godliness, contentment is a great gain. Great gain. Be content. My brother, my sister, content in the Lord. Be happy in the Lord. And one day you see the glory. It is working together for your good. God is making sense out of your situation. And he will bring it out. Don't quit on yourself. Don't give up. Don't throw in the towel. Don't allow it. Fight this good fight. <laughs> Paul said, I have fight the, the, the good fight. And I have kept the faith. You have to fight it. You have to keep it. And you have to win it. Win this life. Kuma kupano. And you mean, but because for when you be able to say, Koji de kupa. Tu adomrika. Have ye no bet frau semo. A kuapano kwafo. What din kunim. At the end, he will say, Fight the good fight of faith. The Lord will give you victory on every other side. The Lord will give you victory on every other side. The man said, no, no, it cannot happen. Situation cannot change. This is impossible. No wonder my life is impossible. My life can change. A child of God, don't sit down. Refuse to quit. Refuse to quit. Refuse to throw in the towel. To refuse to follow people who are failing in life. You know the reason why many people, they quit. They listen. They listen. They have years to listen outside and listening to the Holy Spirit. Every word, immediately, they, they are in that situation, they begin to listen. And when you have ears to listen, you have mouth to talk. Because you hear the devil cause people to speak into your ears. They will begin to bring people who walk in the same situation. The same sickness. Who did not make it when able to make it? But you know the difference. You know Christ. You have seen Christ. And they did not they, they did not see the Lord Jesus Christ. Despite that they may be in the church, does not mean they, they saw the Lord Jesus, they did the right thing. Don't think that everybody that holds the Bible is doing the right thing. There are some people, the Bible says, 2 Timothy 3 and verse 5, that people, many people, have the form of godliness, but they deny the power thereof. Go and read Matthew 24 and verse 24. He said, even the elect, elect, when you read the verse 12, he says, in our last days, iniquity will abound, and many people, their faith will wash cold. 
Many people, they have faith. They have faith in the Lord. See, and we have one even those and even bring one one did the Meaning that they will be in the Lord, they will be holding the Bible, but they don't have any, any, any faith. I pray that you will not quit. Don't quit on yourself. Don't tell yourself that life has come to an end. The good is yet to come. Whether the devil like it or not, whether people write it or not, Jesus is on the throne and you see the glory of God. It shall be well with you. I say it shall be well with you. Except maybe you have decided not to be faithful unto the Lord. Jesus is coming. is walking your way. People of God. The Bible says there were four lepers. They were sitting. Sitting at the gate. They were sitting at the gate. All that they were thinking. What do we do? Maybe you are sitting down and you are thinking. Decisions are very important. No wonder in Deuteronomy chapter 30 verse 19, Moses called the Israelites together and gave them a choice. The child of God, you have a choice. God created you in his image and has given you your willpower to make a choice. But either your choices make you or it breaks you. Either it leads you to Christ or draw you away from Christ. It died opens an avenue for the devil or open an avenue for the Holy Spirit. Your decisions are very important. Make the right decision. And let me everywhere that you are listening to us make right decisions in life. You know the reason why the Bible says that from the beginning of wisdom is the fearing of God. Wisdom is, is when we talk about wisdom, wisdom is doing the right thing at the right time. And the Bible said the beginning of wisdom. Is the fear of God because when you begin to fear God, the Holy Spirit will lead you, and your decisions will be made by the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit can never and would never lie. The Holy Spirit will never lie. That is why the Bible says it is God who ordered the steps of the righteous. People will talk, tell you, Oh, your, your conscience, your common sense, common sense, common sense. Do, are, you, are you telling me that people throughout the whole world, nobody has common sense? Are you telling me that in America, look at her, the number of universities, Germany, Britain, Holland, everywhere. Look at the number of universities, the graduates. Look at the professors. You are telling me that none of them have the common sense that the whole country, everybody cannot become a billionaire. <laughs> I pray that you would understand. It's not by might, it's not by power, but by the Spirit of God. Be patient with the Lord. One day you see the glory of God. One day you smile. As Hannah did. Hannah uh, smiled within herself and said that the Lord has, has made that whoever here was smile with me. Elizabeth said that God, you have taken my reproach away from me. God would take that reproach. If you walk the walk of faith, God will give you the abundance of heaven. The Lord Jesus will never disappoint you. The promise that he is with us to the end of this um How far have you come in this life? You have come too far to quit. You have come too far to give up. You have come too far to throw in the towel. Hold on unto Jesus. The Bible says, looking unto Jesus, the altar and the finisher of our faith, who for the joy set before us endured the cross. My brother, my sister, if you have not accepted Christ as your personal Savior, let me give you this opportunity. He came for his own. But the Bible says his own receiving not. But as many that receive him, he gave them power to become the children of God. Do you know what the Bible says? The Bible says in him is life. And that life is the light of man. And so when you come to the Lord Jesus and you confess your sin, Romans 10, the Bible says that with the heart we believe 
And when the ha -ha -ha mouth confession is made, immediately you do that, he comes and abides with you. And the Holy Spirit, the indwelling presence of the Holy Spirit, will cause you to bear the fruit of life. You walk and you prosper. May the Lord open the heavens and cause you to prosper in every area of your life in the name of Jesus Christ. If you have not accepted Christ as your personal Savior, let me give you this opportunity to accept Christ. Ferrade, don't give up. Remember God has a plan for your life. Remember that God has a plan for your life. Again, know that there is a battle to be engaged. Understand that life there is a battle to be engaged. So be patient with the Lord and allow God to, to lead you. If you allow God to leave, lead you in this life, a child of God, you win. Success will be automatic. automatic because Jesus in the inside will be working on the outside. You order yourself. Understand that too many people are, are losing their battles. Too many people are losing the battle of life. Because through their children, through their wife, finances and life, that does not mean that if somebody is losing, you also lose. Look to Jesus. The author and the finisher of our faith. And for the joy set before him and endured the cross. You also endure and you win. Say this after me if you want to accept Christ as your personal savior. Say today, then you mention your name. I, Kojo Ajua, Rebecca Host, any name. I accept you as my Lord and personal savior. Father, your word says that if anybody be in you, Christ is a new creature. All things are past. And everything has become new. As I have accepted you as my Lord and personal Savior, order my step. Until you come, or call me from this earth. In Jesus' name, Amen. Before we don't leave, we are going to enter into a time of prayer. But before we enter into a time, if you say this, my brother, my sister, find a church. Find a church, a God-fearing church. Not every church <laughs> that you go, you, you meet Jesus. There are many churches, God, Jesus has never been there. Why? I every day tell you, don't go to a church where you feel comfortable and sit in your sin. No matter what you do, you feel comfortable in your sin. <laughs> if you don't know, let me tell you, it is leading you to hell. You say you are judging me, I'm not judging you, I'm telling you the truth. Truth hurts, but it heals. Because it's two. Either you go to heaven or you go to hell. You don't have a choice. The choice you make is that you are going to heaven. There is no third place. Either you are going to heaven or you are going to hell. And so you have to make a choice. <laughs> Something that will lead you to hell, I will tell you. Because the Bible says, for the wages of sin is death. And the gift of God is eternal life. And so anything that is sin, the wages is there. Go to a place where you hear the word of God. Come home with a conviction through the Holy Spirit where you will change your life and walk in the newness of the Spirit. May the Lord bless you and may the Lord cause you to do His will. Uh, if Jesus is coming in His glory, we all will be found holy and acceptable. One day we will rejoice one day we'll rejoice. I love the song by the Church of Pentecost. But I realize that it is not from the Church of Pentecost. It is the Scottish, the Scottish, their festival, their festival song. He said, Oh, what a singing there will be up there. What a singing there will be up there. When we face to face with Jesus, we shall stand and join the heavenly choir in the better land. What a singing there will be up there. What a glory for the saints to share. Oh, glory, glory, glory. What a singing there will be up there. Oh, glory, glory, glory. What a singing there will be up there. No wonder God bless these wives. No wonder. 
Believe you me, their forefathers they were Christian. <laughs> Scottish for Omonium, Omo festival, Omonium, Omo two. Omonium, Omo two for their festival. You see how powerful and how anointed the songs are. Americans say the God we trust. Christianity Believe you me, when you go to Ghana, when we were growing up, Africa, schools, Roman Catholic, Presby, Terian LA, LA Presby. Early <laughs> Matadis as a people, it was built by this this these missionaries. And the Ayamonka, and the Ayamonka, one in war. Yes, I'm calling him Cosuma Bosom, then they are called across the Bianca de Abusum Fiesi, now they are confounded. Nakatra is a that's my sir, and then I saw for me a magician, and then I said, Yaminio, who are Temu Honomo. Come to the Lord Jesus Christ. His love. Amen. Begin to thank God. Let's enter into a time of prayer. Thank God everywhere that you are. Begin to thank God. Just bless the name of the Lord. Thank God for your life. Thank God. Begin to thank God. Bless the name of the Lord. Somebody begin to sing a song. And thank God, bless the name of the Lord. Thank Him, bless the name. His name is Jesus. His name is Jesus. Give Him glory. Thank God, thank God. Bless the name of the Lord. Danya miyasi me biya wo biara wo yena radio so Christo ni. Ora for Danya miyasi. Just thank God. Just bless the name of the Lord. Thank Him and bless His name. His name is Jesus. Rapa kondo rabande reba da bra. Rosande bra kondo. Thank Jehovah. Bless the name of Jehovah. Everywhere that you are. Ora for Danya. That's thank God. Father, we thank you. We bless you. We thank you. We thank you. Come on, thank the Lord everywhere that you are. Lord, we give you all the praise. We give you all the glory. In the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody, we are thanking God for our mothers. Thanking God for our mothers throughout the world. Yesterday was the day of women. And so we want to stand in the garden and thank God for them. Mothers are so precious. Mothers are so loving. They say, Oh, mommy, I don't fear. I always thank God for my mother. Precious woman. And so pray for your mother. We are praying for our mothers. We are praying. And as we pray for mothers, we pray. We use our father, our mother, Mama Bright. Mama Bright, we are using. Mama Bright, Evangelist Bright, as a point of contact, and we thank all women, God for all women, and also Mama Queer, Mama Jenna, continue to mention all the women on EB Radio. Bompaye de Yamia Sia Mamunina, Amen Kamun and Yamin Shiramo, Tumun Quademo, a dear Pierre and Yamia Shom, who be Raman in Bremo, and we hear Christ of Demo, just open your mouth and thank God. Bless the name of the Father. We thank God. We thank God for women. We thank God for them. We bless you. We thank you. In the name of Jesus. Zabonda brakadeba. Rakini bonda brakazonorobo. Rabaye kadabonda brasilerebe. Raboji kadabrakonda rabonda branda zandirebe. Antarabona brakonozo. Andibanda raboji kabranda zundorobo de bria kadaba. Raboji kadabranda zandirebe. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Rakande bonda brakadeba. Somebody thank the Lord, bless the name of the Lord. Thank him, thank him, thank him. Everywhere that you are, thank the Lord, bless the name of Jehovah. Rakade bonda brasenderebe, anda broka da bandere boshi kabranda zanderebe, rabanda raba, rakoda bonda braka zanderebe. Father, we thank you, Lord. We bless you. We give you glory. We give you glory. We give you glory. Rabande rabonda zakara da bria raba, anda braka. In the name of Jesus, 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 Rakada Bonda Braca Zenereme, and the Brocada Bonda Bracada Zenereme, Rabonda Bandaraba. 
Thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We bless you. We give you glory. We give you glory. We give you glory. We honor you, Papa. We thank you. Mantoro bona braka de zeba. Ibona braka do zono bria kadaba. Anda braso no rabona braka da bane bria daba. Ande bo korono bria kadabo zabrana zenderebe. Ara we thank you, Lord. We bless you. We thank you for women. We thank you for our mothers. We give you glory. We give you praise. In the name of Jesus. Oh, glory, glory, glory. What a singing. He will be up there. What a singing. He will be up there. What a singing. There will be up there. When we face to face with Jesus, we shall stand and join the heavenly choir in the bare talent. What a singing. I will be up there. What a glory for the saints to share. Oh, glory, glory, glory. What a singing. I will be up there. Oh, glory, glory, glory. What a singing. I will be up there. I will be up there singing of praises and joy. A day that we will sit on the throne in heaven. People of God, we continue to pray. Bompire. Bompire. We are praying. Everything that calls you. Every place that you have come. In life. That is troubling you. Every spirit. That is speaking to your ears. Give up. Quit. Give up. My brother, my sister. It is not of God. It is not of God. <laughs> you hear voices. That speak to you. The situation will be so compelling that you think that it, it is impossible. But we are praying. Every spirit that speaks to your hearing, speak to your spirit, that it shall not be. It is not possible. We are praying against. We are praying against every demonic impossibility, every demonic gathering, every demonic. Everywhere they have gathered, everywhere they have gathered against you. The Bible says that a thousand will fall at your side, ten thousand at your right hand. With your eye, you will see the reward of your enemies. When in Adam who walk to your pump, I yes, my young woman will be a pill, say you'll be our father one to the bonnet. Will be our church, yet, and I says, I want my own year, yet, yes, my young woman, yes, my young woman, yes, shall we pray? Lift up a prayer, let's pray. We are praying in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray. You are praying against every spirit, every demon that wage war against your life, against your marriage, against your children, every spirit of failure, spirit of, spirit of disappointment, spirit of retrogression, backwardness in a fight against your destiny. Fight against your life, fight against your ministry, fight it in the name of Jesus. Rakebonda Rakando Zobranda Zenderebe and Takonda Rakadebo Rakado Bona Rakande Zenderebe. Father in the name of Jesus. Rabakando Bakale Banda Raba. Rebakondo Rakande Zenderebe. He kanda brakono Zobria Kadaba. Anta Brako. Rakede Bona Braka Sondora Bona Bra. He kanda bra. Father in the name of Jesus. And the blood, the blood. The blood, the blood. Somebody up your mouth and pray. Pray in the name of Jesus. In the blood of Jesus. Rake de mona braka no zono riadaba. Rake de mona braka no zono riadaba. Atokoro branda. In the name of Jesus. Rako de mona braka de zene riadaba. Anta mona braka no zoriba. Anta braka daba. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Rabonda bande riakadaba. Every spirit of fight against. You every spirit that has purpose within this uh, to cause you to fail. We pray against that. We pray against that. Raka de bona braka. Yes, Shumoja. 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 Let the blood of Jesus look at them. Let the tender of Jehovah. Let the fire of Jehovah look at them. In the name of Jesus. Raka de bona braka no zobriadaba. Raka de bona braka. 
Somebody pray. Pray fire. Pray Holy Ghost. Every spirit that is fighting you. Rake de bonda. 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 Rake Keep me true. Lord Jesus, keep me true. Keep me true. Lord Jesus, keep me true. There's a race that I must run. And a victory is to be won. Give me power every hour to be true. Oh, there is a race that I must run. And a victory is to be won. Give me power every hour to be true. Oh, keep me true. Lord Jesus, keep me true. Oh, keep me true. Lord Jesus, keep me true. Oh, as a race that I must run and victory is to be won. Give me power every hour oh, to be true. Stand up. Stand up for Jesus. He so just off the cross. Lift up. His royal banner, it must not suffer lost from victory on to victory. His army shall he lead until every foe is vanquished and Christ he is Lord indeed. People of God, we are praying. Do you know some people sat down and said that they will not eat until Paul fail or die? These people were sitting down, said within themselves that we will not eat. They were fasting for the failure and the fall of uh, Paul. They were poor. They were fasting and praying for that they, they will see Paul fail. My brother, my sister, I don't know where they have gathered against your life. I don't know where they have put to, together a plan to destroy and to bring you down. But we are praying against every demonic gathering. Yabompaye. <laughs> we are praying that whatever they have gathered everywhere they are hiding against your life against your destiny that they want you to fail we are praying we are destroying it in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus let Jehovah rise let God arise let God fight Psalm 35 is a fight against them that fight against me take hold of your shield and your buckler and stand up for hell we are praying into the families Spirits within the family that wage war and fight against. They want to see you fail. They want to see you every day in crisis, every day in trouble, every day in pain, every day. Let fire locate and let tender. Pray into your family, pray into your friends, pray into your community, pray. Every territorial spirit, every spirit that, uh, that destroy, that wants to pursue your life, want to see uh, that you fail, you will never fail. A child of God, you will never, don't throw in the towel, don't quit, you will never fail. You will see the glory of God. You will see the heavens open and you walk under. We are praying against every gathering. Every gathering. Let me read the scripture. I read the scripture. I often read and I love to read Isaiah 56. Isaiah 56 and the verse 6. He <laughs> says that they, they gather themselves together. They hide themselves. Then they begin to mark myself when they wait for my soul. And so every gathering, everywhere they are gathered, let fire look at them, let the consuming fire every day, Mojana and also, we are praying. Oh, be your mouth and let's pray. Be one of Oh, be your mouth. Every demonic gathering, whoever has purpose within their heart that they will want you to fail, they will cause you to fail. Uh, fire locate them. Fire locate them. Fire locate them. Holy Ghost fire locate them. Every demonic gathering, let it penetrate into the camp of the enemy. Let it penetrate through the heavens and bring every demonic struggle. Let it locate them wherever they are, wherever they have hidden themselves. Wherever they are marking ourselves, Father, for failure, for disgrace, for shame, for reproach. Lika bonda brakadeza, rakade bonda raba, rebonda zekata brakadeba, zanta brakadeba. Yeshu majang gramanimo, yeshu majang gramanimo, yeshu majang gramanimo. Oja ungrungrujan tomo nshio, ungrungru 
Lord, we command the power of the Holy Ghost. I command the Spirit of God into their camps, into their gathering, into their Oh, rapa kenda si kado braka deba, rabo taka zante braka deba, rako dobo si kante braka deba, rako dobo na braka deba deriba, zakoro do bria kadaba. Yesu moja gavani mo, Yesu moja. Wosaya wohomo, wosaya wohomo, wosaya wohomo, wosaya wohomo, wosaya wohomo. Every demon gather, rako dobo na braka deba, rake debo na brasa derebo na. A kind of racket about the brass on the Roman Riyadaba, Rabban de Kanaba, where pray the power of the Holy Ghost, Abba Lokeda, Lokeda, they that are within our Father's household, every demonic shrine, altar, altar of destruction, altar that destroy, altar demonic pattern, we break it, we break it, we break it, Holy Ghost fire consume it, lick it and destroy the power of the Holy Ghost, racket the Mona Rakada Sender. In the name of Jesus, yes, come on, yes, 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 Somebody pray. Every spirit that has purpose within itself to destroy. Every spirit that has purpose within itself to draw you back. Every spirit that has purpose within itself not to let you see anything good. Remember, they decided to fast for sport to fail. You shall never fail. Open your mouth and pray. We are praying against every hidden gathering, every demonic gathering against your life, against your in the name of Jesus, let the Holy Ghost fire consume them. The fire that Elijah called and lick up the oil at the altar. Let it lick up every demonic altar in your mother's family, in your father's family. In the name of Jesus, we Jesus Christ your demon, we for him can bear every every demonic covenant in your mother's family, in your father's family. We pray. In the name of Jesus, in the blood of Jesus. Father, we command fire. We command tender. We command fire. We command fire. Every hidden agenda of the enemy against your people's life. Father, we stand in the gap, in the sickle. We will sort for a man 22 and the verse 30. You sought for a man to stand in the gap, build the hedge that you may not destroy. Father, I stand in the gap for the people on the radio. I stand in the gap for people who are watching us on the Facebook. I stand in the gap for people who are watching on the YouTube. I stand in the gap for them. I pray every demonic altar, every demonic shrine that meditate against them, fight against them, wishing and wanting them to fail. You want as a lesson, hear the word of God, receive fire of the Holy Ghost, receive fire of the Holy Ghost, receive fire of the Holy Ghost. Yes, so much young grammar anymore. A bosom, I must say, a pay your home. Yes, Lord, let it locate the Holy Ghost. Let it locate them. I pursue them into their hiding places. I pursue them into their under the sea. In the every heavenly force will bring them down. They fight you, which war. In the name of Jesus, in the blood, rake de bonda rakanda zondo, rabakandi sande brakodo bonda. Yesu majang grama ni mu, Yesu majang grama ni mu. I will humi a diwa musiyeche, a diwa che, a diwa wariyeche, a diwa jumati, a diwa krateche. One pewo saye, one pewo ni mguasiye. Yesu majang grama ni mu, Yesu majang grama ni mu. Bayi tombiara, rake de bonda rakanda zondo, rabakanda rabande rebe. Rabonda kande brakada ba, o yeso deba. Rabonda brakade ba, rakade bonda brakada ba. Akanto brakada ba, rabonda ba ye kada bon kara brande zende. Rikada bonda, I command fire. Let fire locate them. Let fire locate them. Let the fire of the the Holy Ghost look at them in the name of Jesus. Rakodo bonda brakase de rebe in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we bless you. My ye korodo bria kadaba in the name of Jesus. People of God, we continue to pray. You see, 
when you pray, you don't pray against human beings. We pray against spirits. We pray against the Bible says we should resist them and they will flee. And so when you are praying, use the blood, use the name. Through the Holy Ghost fire, locate them. My brother, my sister, I every day tell you, nobody can pray better for you than praying for yourself. No sophomore can pray better for you than pray for yourself. That is why when you read Matthew 6, he said when you are praying, enter into your closet. Enter into your closet and call the name of God. The God that see you in secret will bless you openly. That tells you. He said, ask. The Bible did not tell us that go and ask somebody to ask. Who is somebody can stand in a gap to help you. But you can pray better for yourself than anybody pray for you. And so don't rely on anybody for prayer. Become a prayerful man, a prayerful woman, and you win this life. I have never seen anybody in the Bible from Genesis to Revelation, any prayerful man or woman that failed in their life. They all won. Some walked through fire. Some were in the lion's den. Some of them were as stood as queen from a nation that they did not belong. Esther became a queen. Because of the favor of God. Some walk through the, the seas and everything. And you shall succeed. Don't throw in the towel. Don't quit this life. There is more to life. In Christ there is more hope. Except you decide not to walk faithfully. Except you decide not to walk genuinely or righteously. God is not waiting for your husband to straighten up. God is not waiting for your wife to straighten up. God is not waiting for your children to straighten up. God is looking to you. Begin to walk in righteousness. Begin to hope in the Lord. My brother, my sister, you shall find glory. When you remember, yeah. Mama, so many of you, Papa, so many of you, it's not a dream. But come, 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 come. Hey, would you let the whole church walk to the other side and walk to the Lord? God will exalt you. Nyame, me shen one you nyame. You will be one more. Yeah, brabo, yeah, bo. And it's nyame, yeah, nyame. Say, say, when people are talking against us, when people were mocking us in the church, we were in our room praying and trying to lead a holy life, a righteous life. <laughs> you see, you see, God will exhort you. Yeah, bo, pa ye. No demon can 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 purpose within his or her heart and say that you fail. If you are possible, if you are painful, and demon trust and conscience, will uh, be failing. Whilst you begin to walk in, go and read. Uh, David said in Psalm 37 and the verse 25, I have been young and I am old. I have not seen the righteous. The, the, the word, the word is there. <laughs> Somebody will say the verb. <laughs> that, the, the righteous, the righteous. The righteous forsaken by God, neither his descendants begging bread. And so, you know what? If you walk righteously, it affects your generation. Affect your generation. Walk in righteousness. When you walk in righteousness, you don't need any man of God to even lay hands on you. You don't need. I am not saying there's. No. The, the Bible says when he ascended on high, he gave gifts <laughs> unto men and apostles, pastors, prophets, and everything. I believe in them. But I believe in, in a soul that has been converted to the Lord. Believe in somebody who has turned to the Lord Jesus Christ. I believe in that. And this is something that our entire generation, nobody want to hear. They don't want to hear. They don't want to hear. Every, everybody, they sit in the church. They want to hear. And they are all in the church. They are all in the church. No wonder Jesus said many are called by few are Some people even they don't want to hear anything about righteous. What do you tell us? What do you want? What do you tell us? What do you tell us? What do you want? What do you tell us? 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 Jesus said, even the elect, the elect, go and read the Bible. He said, even the elect, people that he has elected them, they will be deceived in this end time. <laughs> that is what they want to hear. They don't want to hear about something. And all of them are in the church. All of them are in the church. The devil will not cause you to understand. They don't want to hear. The Lord told me, Steve, 
go and preach my word. Even if one person, uh, I remember I went to preach in a church. When we started Church of Pentecost, when you go to Virginia, it is right now, it has become a big church. I hear sorry, can see it. Go. <laughs> oh, my friends, I have forgotten. It was Stafford. Stafford, we started the church. When we went there the first day, I made them preach here. <laughs> see? And, uh, and, uh, and, uh, the Poku or Richmond, he on an air witness leader, and the Miss Nair witness assistant leader. I was the organizing secretary, and we went to preach. America, Church of Pentecost, Assembly, at the we spearhead for about six of them in America. Don't think that you will be on my idea. I remember the first days you call your hotel. I was I paid, I paid me the missing kind of tea. I was handing and handing away the street. I was so for a war. Is this a Yamishra Mubia? We went there, only one woman, Mama, Mama Teresa. And, uh, I, I I preach as never before. And you call you call ya you do no assembly a penna one elder baby sabe. And then I'm calling nipa by and I'm seeing near book hundred. Hey, and you're sorry nanny. You know what? I saw the end from the beginning. I saw the end from the beginning. <laughs> that I believe in the power of the Holy Ghost and the correct when you know nobody and I call nobody mentioned us, but you didn't also. I remember when we came to Houston and you started San Antonio, I'm sorry. I preached PIWC in Houston. I was the president and he liked PIWC. After I finished PIWC, then I would drive three and a half hours to, to San Antonio to, to let me say, sorry. And then I can I can't offer truth say that you show me one elder that can say that God has blessed him more than don't listen to anybody. Don't think your enemy is God's enemy. They Every day I tell people, Don't look at, don't listen to anybody. Because the devil will set people into your life. Oh, Sana Gerson, oh, Sana Ubiayano, Sana Ubiayano, Sana Ubiayano, not in Yama, you who are not sad, because a radius is an He changes, no, he says, I am not a man that changes. Have I said it? Or will I not do it? Do it. I every day tell you there will be a lot of surprises in heaven, the gate of heaven. Nipa be pre or Madu heaven, and I'm disappointed. Because the thing that they, they, are, they are writing their own Bible, they are doing anything. Because semi kunu ba jama inti mesu mi kobo jama in mi iri ba jama inti mesu mi kobo jama in. Hey, there is no scripture in the Bible. <laughs> sin is sin. There is no scripture in the Bible that a sufferer can use it as an excuse. <laughs> a woman can use it as an excuse. And when Tina hears to see the elect, even the elect will be deceived. Who the man suma uradi yena en nanti uradi mu natira kona fani yama iyo mano. And hate people who will preach the true word of God. You hate us. I thank God for God. One day, we will sing to the glory of God. Let's pray this last prayer that the Lord bless you. The Lord order your step. Let this week be your week. Let the heavens be open unto you. When you read Psalm 115, it says that why do the hating say, Where is their God? They rage because, because they don't see our God. Is that we are not ready to do what God has commanded us? 
Already mentioned when in your one of Bompire Yanko. Begin to pray. Commit your ways. Commit your life. Commit your family. Commit them that the Lord should order your steps. Every blessing, everything that the Lord has said concerning your life will come to pass. When Yamim Manas and Biarabaka, our only feed you one memo, yes, or Christ with him, Nasa, what time for Messery. They will rejoice over your life. They will rejoice over your life. Don't give yourself. Don't allow you, uh, you, yourself to be used as a mocking, mocking platform. When they mock you, let them know that there is a God. Let them know that you serve the true God. Let them know that they, you serve the creator of heaven and earth by your life, by walking in righteousness. Walking in righteousness. Because everything that you receive on earth, everything, you leave it. The Bible says, Job never sinned against God. Why? Because he said, naked I came, and naked you go. And so the Rebbe called, hey, our garment of righteousness that will lead us. Only our garment of righteousness. Our garment of righteousness. And then you take it. I pray. Pray, be one on a bumper already. Father, we pray for your people. We pray that you give them long life. Oh, Yamin Fang Quadro Don Shirao. Yamin for an amount to see Yamin Shirao, no one cow, no feed you. Yamin Mawa Nijem Yepeye. When Yamin Bosonia Sassi, on Shen Huan Yunyam. Yariemu or Hamu Amaniemu. When Yamin Shen Huan Yunyam. My brother, my sister, don't throw in the towel. Don't give up. Don't give up. A series I have started preaching. Don't give up. Don't quit. With God, all things are possible. God on your side. Tomorrow, I'll continue. The four lepers, they were outside the gates. All that they were there. They have three choices. Either to go back. They say, when we go back, we will die. When we stay here, we will die. When we move forward, we will die. What is your decision? Do you want to throw in the towel? Do you want to remain? Or do you want to move in the power of the Holy Ghost? May the Lord cause His face to shine upon you. May the presence of God engulf around you. Stand at a place where the presence of God will lead you. And that place in Jesus Christ. Amen. We'll meet again tomorrow morning at the same time. When you come, just share our messages for people that want to, to listen. Who Facebook? Just share for somebody. It will bless somebody. We know how, how we are touching life through our messages. And through our life, I thank God. Me and Crawford, I know me as well. Pay me as well if you. It's like some people even they testify. Brother, be kind. See, I, through you, I came to the Lord. Indeed, I know. I mean, the baby shall have him wanting. If we don't meet face to face. Oh. Yeah, no. Amen. Have a blessed day. Bye.